guys welcome to my channel today i will teach how i made this front design just this front design with this ring please if you are new here or you've not subscribed to this channel hit the subscribe button below this video and the notification bell also like the video and share to your friends but before i start i will explain how i made this one on size 44 so i started with um 30 chains then work 13 rows of single crochet on this front side then on this back side i start with 50 chains 50 chains then work six rows of single crochet on the sixth row i made these designs then complete with six rows of single crochet then at the back here i worked for four chains this long belt i started with for four chains then seven rows then this one i started with 20 chains then seven rows too then fix the buckle so i will teach you what i did here uh we'll be working on size 44 you can see it here size 44 yeah we start work 28 chains One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four, twenty five, twenty six, twenty seven, twenty eight. So after working your twenty eight chain. You skip the first stitch, continue on the next stitch, single crochet. So you walk two rows of single crochet. Two rows of single crochet. At the end of each row, you make a chain and turn. So you walk two rows. Yeah, you can see it. So at the end of second row, you make one chain then you turn so you walk single crochet on the next seven stitches one two three four five six seven and seven then on the next stitch we are going to make so you start to make half double crochet but you don't complete it just watch out like this one the same stitch two the same stitch three the same stitch Four. the same stitch five that's it then you run over that's it then you make single crochet on the next five stitches one next stitch two next stitch three next stitch four next stitch five then you repeat the same thing as it repeat the same on the next stitch one two the same stitch three four And five then yarn over then you walk single crochet on the next five stitches so you continue walking to the end of the stitches yeah you can see it so I finished up with just one stitch at the end so at the end you make one chain and turn so once you turn you make single crochet all through to this point 
single crochet all through. Yeah, you can see it. So on the next row, which is the fifth row, you repeat the same thing we did on the third row. You work single crochet on the next seven chains, seven stitches, then make this design on the next stitch. Exactly what we did on this third stitch. Repeat it on the seventh, sorry, on the fifth stitch. Fifth row, I mean. Yeah, you can see it. Yeah, at the end, you make one chain, then you turn. So you work more two rows, two rows of single crochet. You can see it. So I made, I, I also made the short one. You can see it. So this, this long one. I will fix it like this here. Then this short one will be fixed here. But before that, I will fix it on the ring first. So you fix this way. So we count out four stitches one, two, three, four. So I fold it. The stitches like this okay so you fix yeah after fixing you cut it off That's it. So the short one, you also fix it like this. So you stitch it. You count out three stitches. One, two, three. Then you fix straight. Yeah, you can see it. So we fix it here. So you fix it slanting, make it slanting from here. So this one will be starting direct from the sole, but other ones will be slanting like this. You can see it. Yeah, you can see it. So I started direct from the sole, from the tip here. There at the end, I left about one, two, three, four, five stitches at the end so that is why it has this slanting um this thing position yeah so you try it out on your own and you see how amazing it will be so and make sure that you fix it on the center Make sure you arranged the belt on the center of this front design before you fix.